Hello. Okay. I am. <clears throat> I I just noticed as I was loading this up that I had actually leveled last time. So before I do anything, I'm gonna do that. And I've got a new toy for Christmas, so I'm still figuring it out. I am almost certainly going to be clicking a bunch of buttons and, and it not be the right thing. But, but uh, we'll see what we can do. It won't, won't be too painful. Yeah, it's going to be painful. There's that. There's that. There's that. way to get to my characters. So now I need to remember the button that brings up my character sheet, I think. Yep. There it is. Alright. Not bad. Oh look at this. Oh yeah. So I not only get attributes and combat ability buffs, but I also get civil abilities, which are rare. So I gotta go back to my notes my notes and see if I have any notes on things to do next for any of my folks. Um, I do have some things, but not really in terms of ability points. I don't really see a whole lot. Um, Hydro for quite a while. He's up to eight. And I think that's what I'm going to keep working on. Yeah, I'm going to keep working on that. And then I already got three and Geo and Hydro and then Polymorph. I think Arrow. Hmm. Again, we're going to start clicking on buttons and see what happens. got one spell slot available. She doesn't really do a whole lot with... With air... Well, a little bit with arrow. Man, I don't know if it's going to take me 
me a little bit of time to figure this out. Yeah, okay, I see. So this is this, this is this. Okay. So she's got favorable wind, and then she's got shocking touch. It would be useful to have some... Like, if you look at B's, when you look at his arrow, he does have some pretty decent ranged abilities, like Electric Discharge is not too bad. Um, same thing with Dazzling Bolt. So, it'd be good for her to pick up one of those. Um... kind of kind of give her give her some variety because she's the elementalist so she should have a variety to choose from having said that oh shit that requires source points but oh two source points okay so we, we no big hurry for that one yeah this is this is a good one but i think a ranged ability in arrow would be good so that being the case i think we should bump her arrow up that's what I'm gonna do, but I gotta make a note for myself to add that. Add a ranged arrow spell for um, low speed. Interesting, he's got two in dual wielding, just even though he doesn't use it. But they're both from gear, just by chance. is always going to be pyro so the more pyro the better i'm just gonna keep working on it and then spill she is eventually going to end up with a little bit of something a little bit of everything as a druid but um i really need to keep working on summoning Just gonna, I'm gonna just keep cranking that thing up. Alright, so that's good. So now, let's take a look at the civil abilities. Hmm. I mean, I could. To work on telekinesis. You're going on the boat, sorcerer. Really, what I need to work on is the because he's he's my favorite. Joe's guy. Mom until you're cured. I'm gonna bump that. Oh shit! I will be right back. <laughs>
Joe's mum until you're cured. All right, that sucked. Had a had a liquid mishap. It's all good. It got better. Alright, so I am taking I already already worked on Beast. Bumped up his thievery. Losa. She's my barter. I think, although somebody's my lore master. Yes, yeah, okay, never mind. So she's the one that gets better deals on stuff. I'm gonna go ahead and bump that up real quick. Red Prince, he is my persuader. Sybil is my law master. Um, okay, so now all we have is ability points. Um, Okay, so I took a hit to Khan. I gotta get it back. I took a hit to Khan earlier by the Spider's Kiss. I got Intelligence bumped by two, but I lost two on Spider's Kiss, uh, on the Khan by Spider's Kiss there. So I needed to get that back because his health is not great in the first place. 301. And really, that's true for everybody here. Everybody lost to Khan. Beast is definitely the weak link here with 300 health. But the funny thing is, whenever he gets into combat, even though they pick on him because, uh, you know, he's he's the main character, I'm running him as a primary, for some reason he typically is able to shrug off uh, in, you know, damaging combat pretty well. I mean, his, his uh, resistances aren't that great. I deliberately am wearing this helm. I don't know why. I think I think maybe I need to switch this soon. But uh, he loses. Uh, he's warm, so he loses fire resistance. Quite a bit of it, actually. Um, Fifteen. But you know they're not great. But for some reason, I don't know, just luck or what. They probably pick on Sybil more because her resistances are crap. So. I don't know. We're going to see. Um, so him having 300 health is... Is not the best compared to some of these others. That's 400, 350, 390. But I'm not really seeing a big problem with him. Maybe because his initiative is high. Pretty, I mean, it's pretty decent. So he's, he's getting his shots off real quick. And then he's got tactical retreat so he can move around the battlefield and... He's kind of a, a crowd control sort of guy. I don't know. Well, 
but okay, so everybody's leveled, right? Down there. Cool. Okay, so um journaling wise. Yeah, do you have to bear with me as I figure out what my I got a new toy for Christmas. <clears throat> and uh, it's like a Razor gamepad thing, Tartarus. And uh, I set a bunch of shortcuts up, shortcuts up for this game, but I do not by any measure feel comfortable with them yet, so I have to figure them out. Alright, we're going to go talk to... Um, I think last time we already went down we went down to the cellar of Mortis's home. Pretty darn sure, right? I mean that's this. Mortis's house. It's still showing it as um oh, here, let me switch to beast. Beast. I already went down here. And I explored all of this. The only thing that I couldn't figure out yet is this right here, which is a skull. It's missing an eye. As far as locks go, this one's pretty macabre. Now, I would think, since it shows a lock there, I would think that if I actually had the item I needed versus just some random eye, because I'm sure I've got just random eyes, uh, it would it would prompt me. So, kind of thinking that I need to talk to Mortis. i got to find the dude. See, like here, it's like, I, I don't think that this is going to do anything. See, not enough space. I don't know what that means, though. What do you mean, not enough space? Oh, shit, what did I just do? <laughs> I don't know what I just did there. I didn't eat those, did I? Because that would be awesome if I did, but I don't think I did. Um. Hmm. Kind of wish I'd saved after I leveled there because now I think I just ate them damn things. I'm pretty sure I just ate those three eyes. It didn't give me an effect, though. So if I did... <sighs> the worst player ever. Yeah, I don't see him in my inventory anymore. Oh, man. All right. I really don't want to do this problem again. I'm going to do it. I'm doing it live. It's okay. That's part of the pain of getting a new toy for Christmas. I know. Stop eating stuff. I I didn't mean to eat it. I meant to sh I meant to split it and just try to put one into the eye socket. But I hit the wrong button on my new toy. And I think I just ate them all. And I'm like, blah, 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 blah. That's good. Or not. I don't know. I don't know what just happened there. That sucks so bad. Okay, hold on. This shouldn't take me too terribly long. I'm 
luckily this is pretty straightforward. Except for this yeah. one. Did I change? Yeah, no, no, no. I did that. Yeah. Okay. So. We're going to save that. Okay. Let's try this again. Oof. A little, a little rough whenever I'm saving and trying to move at the same time. All right, so back to this. Maybe I should just right click to split the item. See, not enough space. That's what I thought. So, hmm, that's what I'm saying. I'm pretty sure because it's showing this lock here, that means I need the item. It's a key of some sort. So. So I think I need to talk to Mortis. So I already explored all of this. So whenever it, it's showing me, we find new teachers. Uh, Mortis could be that teacher. That's all good. Um, but I think feel like I need to go back and talk to Mortis real quick. Uh, not Mortis, sorry. Bohar. For the hill people. I'm approaching this the wrong way. I must be. That's where he, he's here, right? Or is he here? No, that's the Magisters. And that's the Meisters. before Mortis makes it all the way past Arx. I asked you for a man, not a note. A tut. He takes the letter from your hands and reads it quickly, face hardening with anger as he reaches the end. Bloody God's damn spit-sucking weasel! <laughs> this is bad. Not just for me and mine. Not just for you and yours. This is bad for everyone. Hell, if I know, but it don't sound good. Seems as though Mordus wasn't mine after all. Trouble is, I don't know whose he is. Of course. That's why I haven't heard from the cave. Sabotage. Sabotage! Listen up, I need your help. We all do. Mordus has his hands on something dangerous. Something I was trying to protect us from. Not just my folks, the whole damn realm. Look, me and mine, we move classified cargo. Take it right off Magister ships and put it into the hands of those that will use it rightly. Trouble is, we came across something no one ought to have. Not the Magisters, not my folks, not the gods themselves. I ordered it to be destroyed. I guess Mordus. Whoever he's working for, wants it for themselves. That can't happen. The less you know, the better. No. Trust me. Stop Mordus and I'll take care of the rest. My people had an operation up in the caves outside town. 
Good access to red ships and plenty of privacy too. So that's interesting he says that. He's got dwarves up in the caves outside town. But earlier when we were talking to the guy that was sleeping upstairs, he was talking about oil and blood, don't mix, and a bunch of other things. But one of the things he mentioned was dwarves in these caves and it not being a great thing. So I'll have to follow up on that. I haven't heard from him in a couple of days now. I thought maybe we'd lost the messengers to Void Woken in the hills, but now I think it's worse than I thought. I bet my lucky left foot Maldus is in the cave. You gotta get to him before he gets his hands on that cargo. Because it mentions an island and the graveyard on the island and yeah, just a bunch of stuff there whenever he was talking in his sleep. Pray to whoever you pray to that it ain't too late. Finally, someone with a little sense around here. Mm -hmm. Give me a map. I'll show you where we were operating, where I think Mordus will be. I don't want to know what will happen if he gets what he's after. You ain't gonna last much longer. Okay, so Kibs at war. Hmm. All right, so we talked to Lohar. He gave us something on our map. But I'm not really quite ready to leave Driftwood yet. I want to... I know that we need to get down to the docks. And explore some there. Check where he marked it on the map. It's a paladin checkpoint. That's the cave right there. So that's a bit west of here. I'm not ready to do that yet. Talk to the kids. I keep I, I kept walking around and let's talk. I swear it. Take that, sorcerer. Dallas, get her. You're dead, Alexander. Alexander, you're dead. You have to stay dead until we say you're not dead anymore. Here, mister. Alexander doesn't have to stay dead, does he? <laughs> Tell Alexander, you very much hope he stays dead. Give them your broken source collar. Okay, first of all, we're going to save it. I really want to see what happens here. The three kids stare at the collar in awe. Then they stare at you in even greater awe. Is that real? Yeah, it's real. I seen the one they put on Joe's mum before she got sent to Fort Joy. A real source collar. This is the best day of my life. Come here, sorcerer. I'm going to put a stop to your shenanigans for real. Look, I haven't killed any children, but I will kill a child. The sorcerer screams and runs away. Dallas and Alexander in hot pursuit, all three children laughing. Wait, what do you got for sale? For some reason, this child is running around with a lockpick. Suspect. Let's see what happens. Anything? That's it? Be gone. Well, but, uh, let's 
that. Dallas and Alexander mock fight their sorcerer foe, the broken collar hanging around her neck. They're having the time of their well, lives. Well, I've got like four of the damn things. I guess I can let the kids have one, right? Dallas and Alexander. Oh, okay. I am almost certain that's going to come back to haunt me. I'm going to save it anyway. I don't care. Okay, so... Go ahead and head down here. Nope. Aw, oh, stinky. I want that. I mean, who doesn't want some poison fish? I don't care if you tear this place apart plank by plank. If we any of you see so much as a rat's hair out of place, stinking up the joint you tell the for eight turns, no less. Then we can get them out, Dwarf. and you can get back. To Have you seen a human acting suspiciously near here? Gray cloak, gray beard, satchel slung over his shoulder. Blast! Well, if you do see anything odd, report it immediately. There is a foul creature lurking in one of these shadows, and we will find him. A sorcerer. He arrived dressed as a tinkerer, but then magisters started disappearing. As soon as we asked him about it, he fled. Who knows what he's done with our divine brothers? Hmm. Why else would he run? If he had nothing to hide, he would have nothing to fear. Besides, he was seen with the effects of one of our company. <laughs> I dread to think how he came about them. We chased him to this factory, but lost him on the docks. Now, I have a patrol to complete. If you see anything, tell me. Oh, we got a high quality fire essence. I will take that, sir. Oh, wait. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry. There we go. Oh, I know you accept my offer. I said, good day. Where is that foul order coming from? Everywhere. Look at it. Ooh. Um... Hmm. A little light if any looting. Of you see so much as a rat's hair out of place, you tell the magisters. Then we can get them out, and you can get back to work. I'm gonna check this out if I can. So, can I just see again? I think we've already learned that I just can't simply close the doors and steal. Look. <laughs> I close the doors and the rest of my party comes in. And they open the doors again. No, that isn't what I wanted. Um, that's why. I'm not sure this is the best for me. I feel like I'm a little spread out. I think I'm gonna do something like that. Okay, let's try that. <clears throat> so let's get everybody in here. Now we're gonna close the door. I'm going to wait for Reed here to wander away because you know. Don't you open that door. Damn it. You open that door. Sir, we were getting ready to loot some stuff in here. Could you please leave? He, look at him. He's giving me side eye. God damn it. Did it? Yeah, why not? Cautionary pamphlet. Why would that be a something you'd get 
busted for. Oh, there's no lighthouse in all of Driftwood. Okay. Steal it. Lock. That lock too. Did it? I'm not sure I'm glad that I s bought all those damn lock picks. What's this? Fishbone. I mean, look at that. That is just awesome looking. Sir. Nothing to see here. <laughs> Nothing going on here at all. Stink of beer almost covers up the stink of fish. We're gonna close this door. Then we're gonna close this door. Then we're gonna pick this lock. Gimme. What? Well, he didn't care, apparently. Greb is not worried at all about me stealing all this shit. Okay. That was pretty good, actually. So... What do we got here? I don't think this is going to be useful at all. I'll comb this place flunk by flunk. I'll find him. Because, I mean, it's worth a lot. It's 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 got a lot of magic armor to it, but it doesn't buff anything. Pyro. See what I'm saying? It's, um... I think this is all about making money. Same thing with this one, because nobody's really focused on Necro, and, and Warfare, maybe... If any of you see, the so Prince... I mean, he's not using any necro spells yet, and I'm not really interested in doing that. So again, same thing. It's, it's the thinking is that I'm gonna sell that. I'm definitely selling this because nobody's doing bows. Everybody's a mage. I, I'm not seeing a reason to have anybody focus on anything other than a staff or a wand. So, this is, I've already got this. Beastar already has this. But, um, I mean, certainly, I almost want to say that Sibyl should be the one doing this, but she doesn't have Hydro at that level yet. I don't know when she will. But I, I mean, I certainly could do that, right? I mean, because she's she's all about summoning, right? And also buffing. If any of you see so much 
So having the ability to regenerate the magic armor for the allies is actually be really good. Her Hydra's at one, so if I just make a note for myself to bump her Hydra up to two somehow, that could be useful. So let me do that. I'll comb this place plunk by plunk. I'll find him. It doesn't mean that that's what I'm going to do right away, but since I got the spell book, I might as well consider it. Okay. If any of you see so much as a rat's hair out of place, you tell the magisters. Doctor the pup. The pup down. The dog sniffs the wooden decking, like there's something wrong. Something's wrong. <laughs> something's wrong, and it's not right. I don't know, but there's something wrong, and it's underneath the floor. Look at the sad puppy eyes. <laughs> Lambo. Be careful down there, missus. You're not smelling what I'm smelling. Hmm. True. salt down here. Uh, Lose is like, I'm not going the way you guys are going. I'm going to go my own way. No, that isn't what I meant to do. Son of a... Turn the lantern off. Look at... Come on. Uh, give me all that poison fish. You know I'm going to make some poison stew later. You'd swear the shark was smiling at you. Lots of... Lots of gross stuff here. Let's get it all. You never know when we're gonna need some poison fish or void tainted fish. And then for some reason just a bunch of coins sitting there. Talk to Presley here. The dwarf reaches into a barrel and pulls out a fish. His knife glides through the scales, crimson guts spilling out in its wake. The innards fall to the floor, landing in a pool of dark bile. You'd expect fish to smell, but these reek. see the nose on my face, don't you? I bloody know it smells, and I don't care as long as it sells. And sells it does. Somehow. Ugh. But the boss has found a buyer for this lot. It's to be shipped off to Ark to the next wagon, if you'd believe it. He runs his knife through another fish and fixes the blade, sending a shower of guts to the ground. I'd say your guess is as good as mine. Except I got the sense not to ask any questions. Now why don't you march on? I ain't been paid to wag me chin. The dwarf turns back to his work, slicing and disemboweling fish after fish as the blood and black bile mix and swirl around his boots. Mm. It's 
So it's always interesting in the game whenever I'm in the middle of a conversation and then it adds something to my quest log. Because at this point, I, you know, you, your first thought is, I want to look at my quest log. But you can't. The dwarf takes a step back. His eyes fall on your huge fists, opening and closing as you grind your teeth. Uh, they're going to the Black House in Arcs. I ain't got the buyer's name. Not even sure he has a name. There ain't nothing more I can tell you. Now get going and leave me be. I did. Rise of the Dwarves. So in Arcs, there's demand for void tainted fish. A man in a a mysterious man in a house in Arcs is buying Driftwood's void tainted fish. Alright, I'm save that. Save it sometime now. Sometime soon. Give me this smelly, smelly fish. to your house and hail to the queen. Does me damn good to see a stout, proud dwarf and no mistake. Huh. So he, he likes the queen. We obviously You wash your mouth with soap, lad. I'd slap you straight if you weren't so damn big. 
Should have known better than to expect the right stuff from another driftwood dwarf. Bunch of doormats, the lot of them. Not wrong. Red say jump and they ask how high. Now wrong, he says. Blimey. A disgrace is what it is. Ho, 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 that's the spirit now we're talking. Boil them red as them fancy robes. The day will come we'll overthrow them. You mark my words. Until then, I'll practice the art of gutting on spoiled fish. Fugitive? Ah, yeah. I don't think that's something I should be discussing with strangers. That's baloney and you know it. An old dwarf like me ain't so easily tricked, kid. No, no, I shan't be baited. I ain't saying nothing on the topic no more. Baited. Alright, so we're gonna try this. But I might have to come back with the prince on this one. No! I said no, and I meant it. Now kindly leave me be. The fish is to clean. And God's damn filthy they are too. Okay. So let's try this. Nope. Hey, come here. Hmm? What? You be needing something from me, lad? Ain't much inclined to rub elbows with lizards if you catch me drift. Ain't no one been standing together since Lucian died. Ain't been mm -hmm. no goodwill among your kind or mine or anyone else's since the Reds have been in charge. Glad to hear you say it. The day will come we'll overthrow them, you mark my words. Until then, I'll practice the art of gutting on spoiled fish. I... I had friends. Good <laughs> friends. Not even dwarves, some of them. Reds put him on a ship, sailed him to Fort Joy. Ever heard of that place? Fort Joy? They send you there means you ain't never coming back. Hmm. You, you've been there, smack in the middle of the lion's den. Damn, Skippy. Crikey. So you're a sorcerer then. In that case, you must know about the fugitive, that fella all those reds are looking there for. There we go. This is what I'm looking I mean, for. If he's a sorcerer too, you want to do right by him, won't you? Make sure they don't catch the poor bugger. The dwarf leans in and begins whispering conspiratorially. This fella runs along, right? Sweating, panicking. Red's racing after him like hunting hounds. Hide in a barrel, you fool, I yelled. And what do you know? He did. <laughs> Problem is, he's still in there. Been hours. Can't go nowhere, he can't. Not with the Reds around. All right. That's what I'm looking for. So he's in a barrel around here somewhere. Okay, let's just keep looking. I mean, you would think that it wouldn't be a barrel I can't actually looking for a good time, get mate. into without it being downstairs in the Black Bull Tavern. Accused of stealing something. the way that Blassin gave you a tip off. Still the favorite. Then we can get them out and you can get back. If I bet against him, I could win big or oh, lose it all. You see a man. Well fed and wealthy, but stress has lined his face and narrowed his waist. He seems to be expecting you. He offers you a large and rusted key. Say what now? 
You took your time. The Magisters are searching the place, and Lohar needs to get his stuff out of the basement if he doesn't want to lose it. Take the proffered key. Basement. Stuff. Got it. Alright. Ooh, look at all the money he got. Oof. Good. And if you get caught, I know nothing about it, and this conversation never happened. There's a good day. Basement here? Yeah, where is the entrance? He gives you a strange look. It's where it always is. Lohar did send you, right? Yeah, duh. He gave me the key. Of course he did. He eyes you suspiciously. Well then, you'll know where the hatch is. It hasn't moved. Well, I'm going to take a wild guess that I can figure it out. Yes, see so much as a rat's hair out of place. You tell the magisters. Then we can Official get out and you can get back to work. Okay. So, I got to find the basement to this joint and I got to find a dude in a barrel. So, okay, let's think about this for a second. Let's go outside here. First of all, we gotta loot all this crappy fish. money. Second of all, go down here. These are all protected. No, man, that's what I wanted. All right, I'm going to save it real quick before I forget. Yeah. Um, Okay, so if I, okay, if I click on this, what happens? Yeah, that's what I thought. So he cares, but he does not care. Still no sign. I'll flash the rat out wherever he's hiding. So, report, did you find anything? Blast. Well, if you do see anything odd, report it immediately. There is a fa- So... Keep hitting the wrong keys on my new toy. Alright, so... Uh, that guy does not like the fact that I'm rooting around. Which is actually a little humorous because he's literally asking me to root around. So, kind of weird. Go back in here. If any of you see so much as a rat's hair out of place, you tell the magistrate. I didn't see anything. I don't know what you're talking about. And you can get back to work. He is none the wiser. 
You know what that means. This chest is going down next. Maybe this bear skin rug. I'm just saying. If any of you see so much as a rat's head. What the what? This dude is nowhere in the vicinity, and yet somehow he noticed me picking that lock. Ah shit. Alright. <laughs> that was pretty funny actually. So that's why if the dude is hiding in a barrel, you would think that would mean that I don't have to actually hit one of these barrels like this one here. Find out. That's a lot of smelly fish. Hmm. Wait, a uh, man can't fit in a pail there, so. Oh, so she cares. Then we can get the That's and you can get the back to first work. time I saw that. And she keeps just wandering here. So it can't be one of these, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. If any of you see so much as a rat's hair out of place, you tell the magistrate. So, again, it's like. Okay. What the? Do I need to repeat myself? Apparently so. But you're the one that told me he was hiding in a damn barrel. I mean, he's got to be in one of these barrels, right? But there's no way to get into them. These or these without somebody yelling at you. Well, that one's empty. That one's empty. Wait. Uh, he's literally standing right here. What would happen if I just like, eh, let's see what happens. And there's not, it doesn't say that there's something in there. It just, Not around here. 
Okay. <laughs> Where is he? Maybe he's here. Let's find out. Uh, let's go hide and sneak in. Um, so really, like, these two right here seem suspect. Oh. Didn't these already show as empty? They did, didn't they? Um, okay. Get back to work. Uh, poop. What do you think you're up to? You're suspect. Just gonna keep looting all the barrels. That's not yours. You don't care. If any of you see so much as a rat's hair out of place, you tell the magisters. All right. Well, you know, certainly not there. I feel like I'm running out of options here. If he's in one of these damn barrels, hell if I know which one. See no damn deer. Nope. All right. So oh. I'll tell you, I was pretty. I mean, there's this one, but I was standing right next to him, and he yelled at me. These two. Well, they both say empty. So, he can't be in there. There's no barrels up here. I already got these. I already got that one. I'm definitely not sure where he is. Oh, this one hasn't been open though. Well, he's not in there. Even though it, I could see what was in there. There's no proof 
like here where they're emptying them out, it's easy to tell which one you're looking at. I looked on that one. But there's still fish in there, so. If any of you see so much as a rat's hair out of place, you tell the Magisters. Then we can get them out, and you can get back to work. Let's go talk to the pup. Hackles raised. The dog barks at the sand built up beneath the building. <laughs> You're nice, and I'm a good dog. Yes, I am. There's something not right, and that's wrong. It's under the house thing there, and it's bad. I can smell it. You be careful now. What's under there smells real bad. It smells evil. Hmm. Got to all that. Yeah, it's definitely stinky. Um, what about over here? No? No. So, he's saying, be careful, there's something here. Where's here? He said, it. and the other dog was complaining about something underneath the building. Seems like this ought to be really easy, right? Here, let me, um, no, I don't know where you're going, dude. I don't know how he started running that way, but okay, let's talk to the dog again one more time. Settle down. The dog stares at a spot beneath the building, a low growl in its throat. A spot beneath the building. Well, I don't see a way to get beneath the building. dog right here. You're still here? Oh, joy! The thing under the floor didn't get you. Oh, there we go. Um, nothing to see here. Save. Oh, it saved it for me, which is always suspect. Oh, 
Oh. I'm like, why is that barrel moving? I'm the barrel. Give me some pie dough. fish here. Just fish buckets laying all around. Chub. More chub. Mackerel. Oh, we gotta loot this. storage key. Oh, it's on this side. Okay. Doesn't that look like a book right there? Like I could just snatch that? I mean, can't reach. Can't reach my ass. I got telekinesis. I'll just pick it up. That's a lot of trouble for that. That's very weird. So, huh. Look, at, I got two face rippers. I just noticed that. Don't think I need a second one.
that key sitting there on that desk. I'll have to come through here to get it. And I guess that all it does is open this room up. Can I get it? No. Not easily anyway. You know what that means? That means combat's on the way. here because I will Look out. how about this way how about you guys oh my god they won't get off of the damn trap useless can I disarm that I don't think I can and it just keeps triggering it. Nope. Nope. Is there a way to... Oh. Well, look, can I disarm that? No? Oh, for Come on. This is ridiculous. Why can't I disarm this trap? Weird. It's not because I don't have a disarm kit. Pack of beer, I like it. Yeah, I'm not really sure what the deal is here. It feels like as if this guy, he's just what? What's going on? Why have I got this thing on me? Incom oh, I'm encumbered. Oh, and then I, <laughs> and then I accidentally pick up something else I don't want. All right, let's uh, let's drop some wooden boxes here. I'm still in. Beast has got a lot of junk. You know what? I know I don't need to be face for that. So, that's okay. Whatever. There's got to be a lever on this other side, right? Some of these bottles look. 
What a hassle. Oh my god. <laughs> of course I did. Um, we gotta fix that. We may have two. He picked up. Oh, wait. Nope. I don't know what I'm doing. What did I just pick up? Was it the shovel? No. Nah, can't be, right? I just accidentally picked up something. No damn idea what it was. That's Los's bag. Hold on, looks like a beast bag. Oh, he picked up a broom. Apparently that was beyond the pale. Here. What I meant to do was click on that lever again. Okay, so what did we learn here, guys? What? God, really? Yes. Uh, I'm just gonna run you through it. How's that? That's what you get. And I'm gonna run you through that one too. <laughs> All right, we're gonna turn this off. Then we're gonna walk him down here. I mean, yeah, I can tactical retreat over here, but that's so, like overkill in order to dodge that trap. I don't think I can climb up there, can I? No. Well, I got a mushroom, so there you go. Ooh, and some gold. wasn't my finest moment in this game. I think I'll rest. And then I'll save. Fish I'm carrying are really heavy. Yeah, look at it. I got 28 of these. Let's um, let's have the prince carry some fish. I mean, at this point, he's carrying almost nothing. He's now the keeper of the fish. Four oranges. Is 
seems like a lot. I know I'm gonna be in combat here eventually. That's not suspect at all. One barrel of fish stands out from the others. It's sealed and marked with a cross. Something about it seems familiar. Oops. Wait a minute. What happened there? I'm gonna reload that. That was weird. It gave a... It, it said something right before it all blew up that I'm not clear on. One barrel of fish stands out from the others. It's sealed and marked with a cross. Something about it seems familiar. Aww. Well, we know it explodes. We also know it's not the guy we're looking for that's hiding in a barrel. source point. Nobody needs any, but that is interesting. That is also a marked barrel. Dripping with liquid source, this barrel is sealed and marked with a cross. From the barrel you sense a familiar power. It thrums in your bones, in your soul. Nothing stirs in the dank and stinking basement, and yet you feel an imminent presence. I don't think there's a ghost around, but there's definitely something not right here. One barrel of fish stands out from the other. Yeah, these are all sploders. Ooh, nice. Here's the key. 
key, which we know that is going to open Good that door. Find. Right? Yeah. Don't stare into the barrel. <laughs> Okay. Ugh. Nice. Ooh, shiny. Packages here, get some more sacks. Okay, yeah, so there's I don't see any reason to blow up anything yet. I still feel like as if something's missing. Like you circle around, you find those barrels, which are marked. There's source over here, which is great, but blowing things up doesn't actually update your quest log. About that. I'll be right back.
Okay. So, let's think about this. You got source here. Dripping with liquid source, this barrel is sealed and marked with a cross. From the barrel you sense a familiar power. It thrums in your bones, in your soul. I'm going to try this and see what happens. Inside, you find not fish, but weapons. Powerful weapons. The kind of weapons the Magisters took from the Hollow Marshes. Oh, wow. Oh. I sure wish I needed these. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Fight. Oh, crap. Um, that's a lot of bad guys. Look at that. That's a lot of bad guys. This is madness, I say. Madness. Okay, so the first things first. These things only have 166 health. They have no armor of any sort. Um... It. That's considered a large area. So he's got four AP. How many of these guys can I hit at once? Three? Do it. That's good. Get these three. That's good. Let's do this now. Boom. Okay. I got rid of a few of them. And because he did the killing blow, he got more AP. Sweet. Um... these guys again. He's hurt, but he's not quite there. No. I want to kill the I don't want any of these guys to get a shot at me. Oops. Who's next, then? These guys over here? Yep. Or you know what? I could just do this. So you, my friend... Not hit them. Oh well, that's not great. Okay. This fire. Oh, this is necro fire. This isn't just fire. Oops. <laughs> um, that's bad. Okay, can I hit this guy? Doesn't look like I can hit them both. You know, oof, look at that though. Take that.
Well, that's oil, but I don't think that... Hold on a second. I don't think... I can, hit, can I hit this? Let's find out. Looks like I can hit that one. Okay. Nope. Didn't hit this. Disappointed. Burn, baby, burn. Can I hit him? Yeah. Yeah, you better go that way. Man, there's still five guys to kill. They all get to go before me. Well, you guys... They can't do anything. That's awesome. Um, can I hit them? I can't now. Oh, you're hurt. You're hurt. Wait, is this characters or enemies? Characters. Look at this. Boom. Here you go. All right, beast is here. You want to come join the fun? Here you go. Here you go. Do a bunch of damage. Man. Let's do it. Why is his necrofire not going away? Who's still alive? There's so much fire. I was like, there's so much fire I didn't I couldn't see that this guy was still alive. Um I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm dying. I'm dead. Wow. That was a lot of crap. That's just not cool, man. That 
That is not cool. Security log, wait, what? Oh, I see. Give it that. Couple more to loot. So, hmm. So that's the whole, there's something bad down there deal. Oh, is that? Okay, so I get it. That's what the guy was talking about whenever he said that the stuff downstairs, if if Lohar doesn't want it taken, he better he better get down there and take care of it. Nope, that was an accident. Let's go back and talk to him real quick. Still haven't found the guy in the barrel. Hey, let's go talk. What? No. Oh, there's a ladder right there. That makes it easy. He glances up, recognizes you. He tries to ignore your presence, fails. He sighs. See here. I'm very busy. The factory is crawling with magisters, and our shipments to Arks are held up. Time is money. Don't waste my money. What do you want? Fish. This is a fish factory. I'm shipping fish to Arks. Now, please, there's the door. I suggest you use it. That's privileged information. Oh, I dear. I trade to protect. I don't think I'm going to pass any of these. Let's see. No. He gives you a cool look. You look a little short on the requisite brain power, <laughs> but I shouldn't think that'd stop you. Good day to you. Don't let the door hit you on your way out. All right, then. All right, no problem. Let's see if we can find somebody who's a little bit more persuasive. You see a man, well-fed and wealthy, but stress has lined his face and narrowed his waist. He tries to ignore your presence, fails. He sighs. See here, scale skin. I'm very busy. The factory is crawling with magisters, and our shipments to Arks are held up. Time is money. Don't waste my money. What do you want? He looks surprised. Might be faking it. Might not. What weapons? What basement? 
Honestly, I've no idea. He stops, sighs. Lohar's smuggling weapons to Arks. He hides them in the basement and I make sure they reach the destination. What they're used for and who uses them isn't my business. And it's not yours either. He swallows, like he has a lump in his throat. You look like the kind of person who's very forgetful with the right motivation. I have a sum of money in my pocket. It adds up to a very good time in the tavern. Hmm. This is a good one. So do I try to take his money or maybe just, nah, you're okay. Glad to hear it. You'd just be buying yourself trouble in this town. What Julian doesn't know can't hurt him. Well, that sucks. I was hoping to get some money, man. What do you got? No. So that didn't... That did not... Update any. much as a rat's hair out of place you tell the magisters then we can get them out and you can get back to work what I didn't do nothing oh you know I'm robbing this chest there's no way I'm not gonna do that okay so where's the guy in the in the um, barrel. I mean, I pretty much opened almost all the barrels here on this in this fishery. Come on, guy, you gotta go. Yeah, there you go. Got it. What else you got there? I want this and I want this. I especially want this. So let me wait till he wanders away and then I will grab it real quick. Give me all that. Alright, we'll read them here. Um, trying to talk myself out of the situation. Oh dear. She is not the best. Or I can just bribe him. No. Oh. <laughs> Thief. Oh dear. Oh dear. This is bad. Oh no. Oh wow. Okay. Let's see what you did there. Oh. I don't know if I want to fight this battle or not. I mean, I kind of do. Wisp. Interesting. Yeah. 
Okay. Magister is not going to be doing well here shortly. Combat, right? One, two, three, four. Okay, good. That's a wall there. Seemed like a good idea at the time. You guys, I gotta fight. Yeah, I mean, this isn't a tough combat for me, but I do question whether I should be even engaged in the first place. I'm killing a bunch of people here. And I'm not sure I should be. Whoa! <laughs> Okay, that was pretty cool looking. They died there. guy's getting ready to come out this door and this guy's getting ready to come through this door so I suppose a smart move would be doing something like this Yeah, 
Yeah, you better go the other way. Carnid is nowhere nearby. Can't cast elemental. I guess I'll just skip. I got you all coming this way. Okay. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Oh, no. That's a lot of AP to shoot to get all the way to there. But it's not as many as it is to get there. down here around. This is weird combat. I still don't feel like as if I should be doing it. Let's shoot you with a laser. Wait a minute. I can't actually shoot you with a laser. I gotta move up. Can I get all three of them? Oh, crap. I didn't notice how many AP I was using. That's okay. I can just hit that. Move up just a little bit further and hit both of them. There we go. Hmm. Too bad. Oh, I hate it whenever it does that. Couldn't do anything about the re magister here, but oh dear, oh that was effective. Wow. That was effective. Beast. Beast is hurting, man. He needs some Comes. I'm through the back door. Ow. Uh -oh. Um, 
Ow! Alright, well that's useless. So he's got everything. He's almost dead. He's almost dead. Um... He's not even got Necro. He's on. He's on fire. Or anything. No. Good enough either, is it? He's not an opportunist, though. Is he? Oh, yes, he is. Here we go. Take that. So we've got this guy with no armor. This guy is almost dead. Far away. Got rid of him. Oh, he can't get the R from her. Why is that 5 AP? Because he has to come around this guy this way. He can't just go straight at him. I get it. Or he could just. Sort of walk that way. That was definitely confusing. Hmm. He's going to get an attack here. What is he going to attack with? He's warfare. Hmm. I'm going to do this. There's a good shot that he's gonna hit me with physical warfare. Let's see. Yep. Mm-hmm. That was a good move on my part. No. Now I'm burning. That's almost dead. He gone. Well, that is definitely not what I was planning on doing. Seems like not the best thing to do. <laughs> right? I mean, I just killed all of those people. I don't care. It's done. I'm not backing it up. Oh, look at that. Fancy key. It's so fancy. Look, I got all this gold. Got all his gold. Already got in here, right? Yep. Same in here. Yep. I mean, is there even anything here now I can't loot at will? I think the answer is no.
I can just loot at will now. Hey, um, I took care of that void woke. What do you think about that? There were bad things down there, but they smell dead now. Okay, I got the right stuff. You don't smell very good either. Are you a bad thing? That's what a bad thing would say. You smell bad. I think you're a bad thing. Well, I probably am. Oh. So I didn't fight Presley. Eh. Go figure. There's still a couple NPCs here I didn't fight. I'm looking in the wrong spot. Maybe he's not here at all. Let's see what this pup has to say. Under the sand are dead, I think, but you, you smell funny. <laughs> you smell of bad things. Maybe you killed the bad things, or maybe huh. you are a bad thing. See, uh, I'm really starting to wonder if it's because I fought everybody there. Hmm. I'm gonna go back. I hate to do that, but I didn't mean to get into the combat in the first place. First of all. Second of all, I feel like as if I'm shutting down too many possible doors. I mean, I kill a lot of people there. That's just not my jam. So. I just don't know when the last time I saved it. I'm sure I saved it right after the Void Walk in combat, but. Yeah. Yep. Okay, so. Before we leave here, let's take another quick look around and make sure I'm not missing something. Like that. I mean, not a big deal. Oh, look at that. I just oh no, 
that's just a bunch of, that's just that triggered trap and all that. I, I explored all that, I'm pretty sure. Let's go down here again. Somehow I missed this first time around, I don't know why. All right, so this time, because I still have the other save, I'm not gonna use it probably, but I'm curious what the dog has to say now. Come here, pup. There were bad things down there, but uh, they smell dead now. You don't smell very good oh, either. Oh, see, didn't make you any difference. Thing. Well, you smell bad, I don't trust you. You smell like all the bad things. Go away. Go away, go away, go away, go away, go away. <laughs> so it didn't make any difference. I thought maybe it did. I still feel weird about that combat like I should. Hey, come here, Reed. You! Have you seen anyone leaving this place? Grey cloak, grey beard, a satchel of books under one arm. Hmm? Lucian's teeth. Where if you see anything suspicious, anything at all. Yeah, it's the same old, same old story. Alright. Well, the dogs don't like me. I'm not really sure why. But obviously, killing all these people didn't make a lot of sense. Where in the hell is this guy hiding? Hmm. What can this dwarf do for one of his kin? I. I had friends. Ever heard of that place? Fort Joy? They send you. You've been there. So mm -hmm. you're a sorcerer then. In that case, I the dwarf leans in and the mm -hmm. English fellow runs along, right? Sweaty. Hide in a barrel, you fool, I yelled. Problem mm -hmm. is, he's still in there. Been hours. Can't go nowhere, he can't. Not with the reds around. See, that's so weird. It feels like as if. Is this where I'm supposed to go the whole time? I'll burn this place down on the ground. Did I not even go in that room? Oh man. Worst player ever. Look at this. How did I pass this earlier? I walked right by this room. Behind the container, the fish in one of the barrels shifts slightly. That's just that's that's frustrating. I'm sitting here running all over the place on the docks and the fishery, trying to find this. And lo and behold, <laughs> he 
it's marked right on my map where to find him. Please, you have to help me. The Magisters have gone mad. I'm a salesman. I tinker. I fix things. I wonder. I buy and sell books when I can. I, I, I had nothing to do with those Magisters vanishing. Please help me. I don't want to die. I don't want them to take me. I just need to get out of Driftwood. I can't risk being seen. But if you can get out of town, I can escape to Ox. Please, I'll do anything. Just don't let them see me. Don't let them find me. Thank you, my oh. Lucian. Seven Save times the game. Time. Thank you. I'll follow your lead. But please, be careful. If the Magisters see me, I'm done for. Okay, so... So I need to get him out of town. Okay, and that makes sense. I can either take him to the Magister or I can take him somewhere else. All right, we'll save that. So, the Magisters are over here, right? Yeah, he keeps walking up and down here. Which means I probably need to get somehow down here. No, that's not going to work. Yeah, oh, it might work, actually. Let's find out. Hold. Nope, nope, nope. What? You, you oh my me. god, I'm the worst. Thanks. Let's try this again. Now, stand they took so long to wander over there. Okay. I've added nine chronicles. That seems like that seems excessive. Not sure how finicky this thing's gonna be. My guess is I have to somehow, I mean, he's only running up to here though. I was thinking, oh, maybe I have to, maybe I have to run him this way because he's patrolling here. Now I'm not so sure. I mean, if you look, that's the only Magister, right? Yeah, it looks like it is.
But I'm wondering if he'll see him through this. Oh, that's a... Oh, oh, hold on. My bad. That's a magister right there. Right there. So I can't... There's... Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. You. Oh man. Oh reloading. Okay, so I'm not really sure. <laughs> really sure which path to take here. I accidentally attracted the attention of one. I didn't realize and he was chasing me. I'm like, oh shit, I'm out. So I found the dude. There's gotta be a way just to get out of the frickin' docks area. So, there's a guy in here. Even these guys, I think, yell about him. There's a guy here. There's this guy. Um... Oh, and there's a magister there. Ah, oh, jeez. I can come this way. I think that's what I can do. And then I could get down to the ground here. Nobody should see me. Look at these jackasses. Oh my God, I can't believe that just happened. Oh, the pathing is good sometimes and then sometimes it's so bad. Uh, not that it matters necessarily because I'm not now I'm starting to wonder if this was the right path any after all I don't think I can get past this guy and this guy Shoot. I might be able to Let's see what this does Ooh, look at that run Don't go that way. Go this way? You! You found it! What? Him. Where did he come from? Stand aside. Nope. Reload. That's that doesn't make any sense to me at all. He was not there. Physically was not visible. And then suddenly I climb up there and he's he just shows up. Well, I gotta get him out of town. So what does that mean exactly? Let's look at the map.
I mean, I could just run to here. So how, where did that guy come from? Let's just say I pull her away. He's gonna follow, it doesn't matter. No, no. You, oh my you gosh. So it doesn't even, I mean, the second he pokes his head out there, that, that guy is gonna see him if I'm too close. I'm dumbfounded what I'm supposed to do here. Can't make him hide because he doesn't hide whenever I hide. I can still try to do what I was trying to do there, which was I didn't mean to move Beast. I meant to move Seville. Let me try that. I just want to wander over here and see. Was it this guy that chased me? No. All right, so I can go this way. Farland Circle. No, see, but there's no way down from here anyway, is there? No, but if I get down here, can I go this way? Can I go this way? Nope. But I thought maybe, looking at this map, that there was a path right there. It seemed unlikely. Yeah, see, no. That's not happening. So I can't... I could go this way. I guess that's what I need to do. I need to... I was close. Now I could also go up here and talk to this guy. And distract him. Let's do that. Try that. And you can get back to work. I haven't really done much of that in this game. Elf, have you seen a talking to him. At last. There I'm we sure go. Die in that wretched place. You have my thanks. If not for you, I probably would have been found, gutted, and salted. I can't just saunter away. Who knows what might be lurking in a place like this? <laughs> He's like, I just like smelling fishy. But once I'm sure the way's clear, I'm running to Ox like a cat with its tail on fire. I'm done with this stinking town. Oh, of course. Here, this is the most powerful scroll that I have, and the one that caused all the trouble in the first place. Take it. I hope I'll never see its like again. 
in the kitchens of the tavern of all places. That cook had Ooh. offered it for a great price too. Busted. I thought she was an idiot selling it so cheap. Then again, I'm the dolt who ended up in a barrel. But if she has majesty artifacts, she must be the one they're looking for. I swear, once I get to Ox, I'm going to have the bath of my life. Inflict poison on contact. I just wish it had decent magic armor. 11's kind of meh. Wow. I'm not really sure. Uh, my choices here are interesting, but nothing leaps out at me based on what my party needs. I mean, I could probably always use a little bit better armor, and this is probably better than what I've got. Oh, man. I wish I could just see my... I could see my stats real quick. Let's just do that. All right. See what I'm saying? Wait. Wait, no, hold on. I keep forgetting it doesn't. Yeah, see that Oh yeah. Um Did never you see mind. anything suspicious? See, I never do that. I never think that oh I can split the party in this scenario. And distract with one character wow because I never you, you usually don't have to do what I just did but still it was interesting I could do that All right, I'm gonna save that Yeah, this is this is just something to sell. I mean, there was nothing there that was great. This bartering plus one's actually interesting, but again, I don't think it's better than what I got. Well, yeah, resistances are better, but still, it'd be nice to have. I'm just going to leave that right there. So, Wivlia, the tavern. She is definitely not right. So, let's go have a talk with her. Please 
I must insist you keep out of my kitchens. It's not safe for you to wander about like this. Higbert told you that. He's a fugitive, supposedly a sorcerer too. He'd say anything to save his own hide. I killed no one. The cook doesn't respond. You notice that she has one hand behind <laughs> her back when she hadn't before. The cook smiles. Her oh. eyes bore right into you. Her hand remains concealed behind her. The Magister's helped me. And the dwarves, the merchants, the pilgrims, even the dogs helped me. I'd never harm a person, my sweet. Only dumb animals fit for the cooking pot fall to mine. Ew. The things you're insinuating about me require proof. And it seems as though you have none. So don't you pit your word against mine. You'll only lose. Now get out of my kitchen. She is evil. <laughs> but if you want some of that meaty stew, you know what's in it. Nothing more for you. No food, no words. Get out. The cook shakes her head ruefully. You should have just forgotten about all of this. Fight! She's invisible, but not for long. Well, and then she attacked me while she was invisible. That doesn't make any damn sense. So he lost all of his physical armor. We are definitely putting that back. First of all. Second of all. You. Oof. Barely been touched here. Might need some healing. It'd be nice if I could do something about her. It hit him. That was not the plan. That'll help. Okay, 
earth. She gets Is that gonna hit me? Wait, is that enemies? This says characters. That definitely hits me. That doesn't. Okay. Oh wow, she's almost gone. Now. She's definitely gone now. Three hit points is embarrassing. All right, well done. Stew is good if you're thinking of eating. <laughs> the steward, he's outside. I can go talk to him real quick. See what he has to say. Good marbling on Master Virgil. Marinate Magister Stanley. Oh dear. Oh, she can eat this. A lifeless elven child is cradled in your arms. Your vision blurs with tears. You look away to a raised valley below. Tendrils of death fog dissipate, revealing a victorious Divine Order army advancing. Humans, magisters, murderers. Oh, so she was not necessarily a bad guy. Okay. <laughs> there is definitely something wrong with this. I'm gonna get all this goodness. Talk to the match. Oh, no, 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 wait. Before we do that, go talk Come to on. Mr. Stewart. What is it? Unless you know something about the disappearances, leave me alone. I need to concentrate. The, the cook? 
Of course, of course. I had worked it out for myself, naturally. I was just about to present my findings to the mm -hmm. magistrate. Well yeah, done, right. stranger. So it was an elf all this time. Perhaps the Magisters were right to remove my kind from their ranks. The Fiend has faced justice, I assume. The Elf's face falls a little. The chase is over, and he remains outside the Magister ranks. And, and did you tell the Magisters? Did you take the credit for solving the disappearances? Well, in, in that case, I might just... just... Oh! He's, he's gone! Oh my god, he's gonna go race over here and tell this guy before I can tell him. Oh man, that is suspect. Surrounded by income. I suppose you've heard of the disappearances around here, have you? Well, the case has been solved. Thanks to oh. the Magister. Or rather, an ex Magister. I don't reward Craven. Oh my god. <laughs> now get out of here. <laughs> no way, man. I work too hard for this. That is not right. Wilson, my inkwell is dry. So. Fetch me some right more. Away. That's funny. So when did I say flat? It's been a few minutes. All right, I'm gonna reload that. That's that's suspect, man. Have him race over there and claim credit while I'm I'm literally right next to him. That was fun to see what he would answer, though. Okay. And in fact, I want to even back it up a little bit. Because it didn't really occur to me that she is not the bad guy. The magisters are the bad guys. So, I mean, I may just end up fighting her anyway but it seems like as if we can come to an understanding it's like look that stew's messed up but um i'm okay with you killing magisters let's see and she was an elf right so let me have sabil talk to her let's see what happens Acknowledges you with a graceful little bow, but keeps her eyes on Much you the whole time. Much nicer to me. There's nothing here for you, sister. You should go back out front, where it's safe. There are other elves, ones who aren't working and have time to talk. The cook's hand moves behind her back. Hadn't there been a knife on the table a moment hmm. before? I find dignity in other ways. Those who gorge themselves out there call us savages. But I know differently. 
Now, please. Keeping one hand behind her back, she gestures to the door with the other. Cinnamon, not nutmeg. There's a food shortage in these parts. Fresh meat can be hard to come by. Liberal seasoning helps disguise all sorts <laughs> of sins. That's awesome. Now, please, I must return to my work. So, no matter which way you proceed here, you're going to end up in a confrontation. This ring, it bears the Magister's seal, and there's blood on it. See, it says flat out you have to confront the tavern's cook. So... I must insist you keep out of my kitchens. It's not safe for you to wander about like this. She grabs the ring and glares at you, like a rattlesnake observing its next Ooh, blind wait a minute. You should have just kept out of this. She gives you a defiant Okay, look. this is what I was looking for. Magisters are obliged. They deserve worse than the death I gave them. I wouldn't taint the earth with their carcasses. Better that they vanish into unsuspecting stomachs. I don't want to be lauded. If word spreads of what I've done, the Magisters will swarm all over me in an instant. I can't let that happen. There's a carving knife in her hand. Oh, you wait, 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 wait. Pick it up. I have more work to do, more Magisters to rid the world of. I can't leave any loose threads. Oh, wow. Okay. She gives you a long look, unsure, then decides. Betray me, and you'll meet the same fate as the others. Ah, see, now that's go. what I was looking for. Something like that. Okay, cool. Perhaps we could do more to protect her. Really? The cook nods at you curtly. Remember what I told you. Betray my trust and you'll pay. Just oh. like those magisters did. Okay. I'm just... Nothing to see here. So, okay. That's more of the kind of result I was looking for, but the question is... What can I do here? What's this? Damn it, Barwell, you're supposed to be stopping intruders. There's still a fugitive on the loose. Barwell. It's... Bellworth. It's Bellworth, <laughs> sir. And the fugitive's description doesn't match. I don't care. Keep on alert until this fiend's head is on a spike. I don't want to end up like the others. Now, you... What do you want, dwarf? You can't just come in here as you please. There's magisters missing. I'm trying to conduct a bloody investigation. Oh, this is interesting. So I could... I wonder what the choice is here. Let's find out. Well, what are you waiting for? Tell me. Oh, so you can just tell him it's a cook. That isn't what I was looking for. Of course I wouldn't. What good have bloody dwarves ever done for anyone? Now answer me. Why are you here? Well, mind your bloody huh. step in future. I've an investigation to carry out, and I don't need any more distractions. So, can we frame Stuart? Let's find out. 
kind of feels like we can because I've got the ring. Oh, she took the ring back. All right, let's see what happens. What is it? Unless you know something about the disappearances, leave me alone. I need to concentrate. The elf straightens to his full height, martial and unwavering. I swore an oath. I won't turn my back on it. Not now, not ever. What? And you think that's an excuse for me to stop trying? I'll never stop. Not until this matter is settled or I'm dead. The... the cook? Of course, mm. of course. So it was an elf all this time. Perhaps the Magisters were right to remove my kind from their ranks. The fiend has faced ju- It matters to me. Now answer me. Is the murderess alive or dead? I am a Magister, don't you understand? Mm. Even if they don't want me in their ranks anymore, I'll always be one of them. Now answer me. The elf glares at you with alarm. You left her alive? I won't let that foul bitch get away with this. I have to stop her. Let's do it. been killing my comrades. Comrades? You shame your kin, siding with those dogs. <laughs> ha! Okay, that was awesome. Now, is she gonna be pissed at me? Oh, she closed the door. She's gonna make some more stew. Oh, I gotta check this out. So is that what it meant? We, perhaps we could do more to protect her. Well, that certainly was something that protected her. Um, let's see. You should not have seen that. Um, and you cannot unsee it. Wait. Come here. There's no need for this to be more painful than it has to be. Whoa, 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 wait. No, 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 no. Let's go back. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I really, I feel like as if there's something else more I can do here. Because I got him killed. She knows I already know. So why would she turn on me then? Actually, this might be a good place to stop and pick it up next time because because it's time for dinner. So let me do that. I'll write myself a note for the next time. We're gonna follow up with killer. Stewart was killed. I'm just curious if I tell the magister that she did it, if she also killed him. Because that would be awesome. Anyway, that's for next time. Later.